Tomo's P-39 was replaced with a new aircraft, the P-51 bomber, and it was in the P-51 that he performed the act of bravery which earned him the Congressional Medal of Honor. The date was 11 January 1945. Two P-51s of the 82nd Tactical Reconnaissance Squadron were returning from a recon mission. As they came in over Mindoro Strip, the lead pilot, Captain Arthur Shomo, executed a victory roll, indicating that he had destroyed an enemy plane. Ground crews looked up surprised. But Shomo had only begun. He went around again, did another victory roll, and the men on the ground started counting. Two planes down. When Captain Shomo executed his third and fourth victory roll, it brought out the brass. By the time he was making the fifth, the sixth, and seventh roll, no one would believe it. Seven victories seemed impossible. He was just showing off. Showing off, perhaps, but with good reason. We were flying in the Philippines and getting ready to make the landing at Lingayen Gulf above Clark Field. So they wanted to know how many Japanese aircraft in northern Luzon could oppose this landing. My wingman and I were sent out with specially equipped photographic type P-51s with guns on to determine photographically and visually what they could oppose the landing with. So in the course of making this reconnaissance, we spotted a Japanese Betty bomber escorted by 12 fighters, Japanese fighters, which was a Japanese fighter squadron. In the course of uh, about 12 minutes total, uh, we made it an attack on the Japanese flight. I shot down six of the fighters and the bomber. My wingman shot down three of the fighters. The other three Japanese fighters got away in the clouds and escaped. Certainly, it takes a lot of courage. That's why you got the Congressional Medal of Honor. But what were your feelings at that time? You know, what do you go through as a pilot uh, involved in that kind of action? Surprisingly, I had been over in the war for almost 16 months at that time. This was, <clears throat> with the one exception the day before, I had never had the opportunity to actually get a crack at an airplane in the air, that is a Jap airplane, while I was flying. I'd seen them while they were bombing our bases, but never while I was airborne. 